Visualizing mouse prints in a standardized 3D reference space such as the Allen Reference Atlas is crucial to understanding the connectome or the wiring diagram of a brain. In this work, we introduce a framework to create such visualizations from conventionally produced mouse print slices which may contain histological artifacts. This is achieved by constructing an annotated 3D reference space and aligning the microscopic mouse print slices to this reference space. However, this direct approach is extremely challenging because of histological artifacts in the microscopic slices. There are two other indirect ways of achieving this alignment. One, through intensity atlas slices and another through annotated atlas slices. However, alignment of microscopic and intensity slices require both of them to share a similar intensity profile which can be difficult to satisfy at times. This leaves us with only one approach where we first construct this 3D reference space by performing surface reconstruction using annotated atlas slices and then align the microscopic slices to these atlas slices using feature-based nonlinear registration. To perform surface reconstruction of the mouse brain, we first align all the annotated atlas slices while preserving the relative shape and scale of individual regions both within and between slices. We then 3D reconstruct individual regions to ensure geometric and topological correctness. Here in red, we show the reconstruction of the hypothalamus and its spatial location inside the mouse brain. Once all the regions are reconstructed, they are put together and any intersections encountered are resolved semi-automatically. Using our technique, we reconstructed 20 major anatomical regions shown by different colors, where each 3D region is a smooth manifold mesh without any intersections. This virtual mouse brain model can then be re-sliced at arbitrary orientations and slicing interval to get a virtual slice. These virtual slices and their corresponding microscopic slices are then aligned using feature-based nonlinear registration. The first step of registration involves extracting features or contours from the input images. A traditional canny edge detector produces a lot of spurious edges and fails to generate clean contours. Using our dominant edge detection algorithm, we identify and remove these small spurious edges to generate clean microscopic edge image. A similar procedure extracts the atlas edge image from the corresponding atlas image. Given these two images, we now perform their alignment. However, presence of damaged regions in microscopic images introduces false correspondences and incorrect alignment with annotated atlas images. We use constraint denoted triangulation and symmetry to compute these damaged regions and remove those feature correspondences. Using the remaining features, we find the correspondences between the microscopic and the atlas images and accurately align both of them by solving Laplace equations with Dirichlet boundary conditions. We now show the results of a nonlinear registration on a few microscopic slices. Here, we showed three coronal mouse print slices with tissue tears overlapped with their corresponding annotated atlas contour images in white before registration. Using our registration technique, we achieve accurate alignment between the two images. Note the precise alignment in the interior of the tissue even in the presence of the tears. Our registration technique also works for clean slices. Here is the result of our registration on three such slices where the top and bottom rows show the overlap before and after registration. Aligning microscopic slices is extremely hard, especially in the presence of artifacts. Here is the comparison of our feature-based registration with the popular intensity-based registration from Elastic, where the yellow arrows indicate few locations of incorrect registration. To show the importance of identifying histological artifacts, we also show a comparison of our method with and without damage region detection. Note, when we do not detect tears, they get aligned to the features of the atlas resulting in incorrect registration. Using our framework, we can now map the microscopic slices even if they have histological artifacts onto the annotated 3D common reference space. This allows us to visualize the spatial relationship of the microscopic slices with the mouse brain. It also allows us to transfer annotations from the 3D reference space to the microscopic image space and facilitate diverse studies such as region-based gene expression analysis and understanding of complex neuronal interconnecting networks. We conducted one such study where we segmented and counted the number of neurons in each 3D reconstructed region. 
Here we show segmented neurons from 51 registered microscopic slices inside the reconstructed mouse brain. These neurons are color coded by the regions they are present in. Such studies help neuroscience researchers better understand the functions of the brain.